what's up everybody and welcome back to my channel today I'm gonna be doing another cooking video um, this is gonna be my second cooking video putting on my YouTube channel um, I know the first one was venison cheeseburgers so um, this one I'm gonna do is venison breakfast burritos um, never made this before so this is probably gonna be the first time that I uh, gonna try this out hopefully it turns out good so let's go ahead and I'm gonna show you guys what I'm gonna be using so I got my ground meat right here that I'm gonna be using um, got my onion my green pepper, red pepper, eggs, I got my Mexican four cheese, my portillo shells I'm going to be using, got my taco sauce, and got my pan for the eggs and pan for the ground meat. And then I also probably going to be using taco seasoning. I'm going to go ahead and get started here. Alright, so what I'm actually going to do first here is get this stuff off. Get off this onion. Right, so let's go ahead and get my uh, all the skin peeled off the onion. So I'm gonna start cutting this up. So I got all my onions and my peppers all cut up. So I'm gonna go ahead and ground venison into the pan and then I'm gonna toss that stuff in there so I can all saute it. Toss my ground venison in and now I'm just breaking it up. So that way I can get it all mixed around with once I put all my peppers in there. This one. I'm gonna just scatter it all up. A little bit of milk, splash, just so I can fluff it up a little bit. A medium. Throw that at medium. Put that at medium as well. Just a little low, actually. Alrighty. This is probably going to cook for a little bit well with eggs. Eggs shouldn't take long. I think eggs should be done before this. Make sure we're getting about done here. And once this ground meat starts browning up, and then I'll throw the seasoning in there. It's smelling really good right now. So, I really can't wait how this is going to turn out. I can already smell this stuff, it's already good. There's Kelly. Hi Kelly, say hi to Kelly. We got Trey here, got my little audience just to watch. <laughs> so I'm not really a professional cook, like the best chefs out there, but um, if anything comes to basic to where like I think I can do it, I'll try it. But uh, it's the only way to learn, you know. This is my second cooking video for my channel, so I'm hoping this turns out really good, like I said. Now it's time for the seasoning, because it's already pretty much all browned up. I'm going to use the 
original taco seasoning. Smelling really, really good right now. Mixing all the seasoning with the meat and the peppers and onions. So the last step will be, after all this is done, I'm gonna throw these onto the stove so that way I can kind of get a brownish color on here. So I'm gonna throw it on here, turn the, the heat on low, and then probably like 10, 15 seconds, flip it over to the other side, and then it'll be ready. I'm probably gonna do maybe three of them for now, because I'm probably gonna be able to eat three. All right, go ahead and toss, I'm gonna toss this on this side. This, this piece is kinda hanging out a little bit. So, yep, just leave it on here for maybe 10 or 15 seconds, and then I'll be able to flip it over. You don't want the heat too high, otherwise you're gonna burn the tortilla. See how it kinda gets a little bit of a brownish color? You don't want it too much, but probably like that is perfect. I should get a plate. Just like that. Both sides. Now it's time to do the same thing for the other one. <clears throat> Flip it over again because the other side don't look too good. I think that would be alright. This one, let's sit for a minute. This is all done. The eggs are already all done. I think it's time to flip this guy over. Yep, just like that. That should be good enough. Alrighty. Alright. Try to get maybe at least one of each in there. A little too much, but it'll be okay. A little bit of eggs on there. I could toss a little bit more actually at this. That looks like that's good right there. Perfect. And for a little bit of cheese. Just a little extra more. Throw a little pepper in there, just to get a little bit of a good flavor. Now, last but not least, a little bit of salsa. Wow, look at that. My first venison breakfast burrito that I ever made. All right guys, so let's give it a try. Really, really good. Wow. Wow, guys, so that definitely turned out really good. I definitely nailed this one for sure. Um, I'm definitely going to be making more of these for sure. Um, so, but um, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys like this video, give me a thumbs up. And also, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. And then stay tuned for some more, guys.